That's incorrect, but okay, I'll take it. Yes, I'm gonna throw you all the time. <laughs> and then never throw them and just not carry them to fucking heaven. Wow, he's very oiled up. I never noticed that before. Round one. Ready, go! Thank you, Ray. Oh my god! You can get track, no tracking. Here. Should be in my profile. If it's like if it's not though, that's good to know. All support, support in the game. These are all customs. These are all costs. Everything in here is, is, is in the game. That was a 9,000 K. That was one hell of a motherfucking first round. Jesus fucking Christ. Jesus Christ. I'm not ready for this. It was so tense. It's very intense. It's a continuation from what we were doing last. Uh, oh, thank you for the raid, Peach. I appreciate you. Thank you. Thank you. We are training with Paul right now. He was here last week, offline. We got to play on the arcade together. And now we're continuing the intensity of that set, but now offline. He's the Akira. Need a button, I can't believe it. I could have, I could have, I could have done that. Could have gotten that one. Round 
Mm, mm, mm. The dangerous game you're playing there, Paul. It's a very dangerous game you're playing there, Paul. This is not a new game. Couldn't evade. Why'd you break both walls? What the fuck? Why? <laughs> oh, it's over anyway. Dangerous game Paul's playing. I like it. I like it. This is like a... So this came out in 2021, I think. This version of the game. But it's been around for, since like this. It's the exact same version. <laughs> Paul's like, YOLO! YOLO! I got him. Mm. Look at look at his character. Look at his character. Nice factor. Bastard, you confident motherfucking piece of shit. Oh no, we can. What the fuck? <laughs> We're breaking the internet. And then start it again. I, I don't know. <laughs> I don't know what the fuck that was. We were too hot. I think we broke the game for a little bit there. What's the question? We love a dangerous game. Oh, yes, the game is very dangerous. Thanks for coming, Light Beach. Yes, go run, get some food. Keep me tapped up, baby. Thank you. Paul requires my full attention, or I'm going to get fucked up. So I am focusing hard right now because he is my uh, uh, most skilled opponent I have to play on a regular basis. I love you Setsuna but this guy is really good. <laughs> I know Setsuna knows that. Of all the students I'm training he's the one that uh, pushes me to such a degree that I'm like students can become better than the masters then. Don't stop breathing, don't stop breathing, don't stop breathing. Yes! So as you notice, I sometimes talk to myself. <laughs> because I'll forget to breathe. Like, and you, and you don't want to do that. Don't, don't, don't stop breathing. Ah. Yes. Yes. 
Yes! yes! Play the dangerous game, Paul. Play it with me! This is the game we get to play. This is the game we get to play now. It's time for the next level. It's time for the next level. This is what it is. This is what it looks like. I'm very excited too. I get to so rarely get to do this. <laughs> I feel like a I feel like Frieza right now, who's like having to go into her final form, and she's never done it before. I mean, whatever, you know, Frieza, whatever. You don't know what Frieza is. <laughs> Paul's feeling it too. She's like, oh, he's like, oh fuck. Like I never had to go this strong. I, I haven't had to go this hard in so long. But I'm doing it in a controlled way. I've done it before, but I wasn't like I didn't have control over it, so I couldn't. I couldn't adjust as well as I'm trying to right now. I didn't have to do that. I didn't have to do that. I'm up. Oh no. Oh no! You confident bastard! Well done. Well done. I see. Good choice. Patient motherfucker. This virtual fighter. This is virtual fighter. Yes, they are. It's virtual, no L. Unless you're on voice to like text, like voice to text or something. Round one. Ready? Go! Yes! I wonder who would do that. Yep. I thought I broke that. I thought I broke that. This is in Tekken. Round two. <laughs> Ready, go. Hmm. There we go. Didn't break it. I didn't, didn't block. Oh. I did. I'm dead. <sighs> so hard to control it. So hard to control it. Mm. Fuck. You're going for the down, down, forward, down, forward, down, forward. Three, three. I want to find a better way to like punish you for it. Knockout. 
out. Those jabs feel so good to hit. They feel so good. It's like pop. Ah! I love it. No! Couldn't do that one. Ideal for type. You're correct. Okay. This character still. Don't stop looking at this character. Believe. My job. I think that's not an AOP. It's called shoulder. Her shoulder's an AOP, and she has that. I think it's very bad in this matchup, Nala. It's so one of her worst matchups. Austin Smith, yes, they are very similar. This is still five. This is just not vanilla five. This is ultimate showdown. Let's go. That's a dangerous game you play. Round two. Ready, go. What? Knockout. Round three. Ready, go.
Let's go! Has Tekken helped keep things sharp when you get back to VF? I mean, I still play. Who's her best matchup? Owie. Owie. Because sh sh Eileen blows up all of Aoi's strongest tools for free. She doesn't, she doesn't have to change her game. She doesn't have to change her game plan that much to to stop Aoi's game plan. So a knowledgeable Eileen will blow up at Aoi. Any light character, basically. Ready, go. Oh, it's not right. Excellent. That was one hell of a round. round three. Ready, go. I must have been late. Here. I must have been late there. Ready, go. Mm. Okay. the hit I needed. I had the hit I needed. I had it. I had the hit I wanted. And I just didn't do shit with it. I'm sad. So sad. When you saw him like turn to the side ever so slightly after he got hit by the wall, that was death. He could have died there, but I didn't do the combo I needed to do to convert properly, so I didn't kill him. Oh. This character. Nice choice. Not what I want to have happen at all. Neutral. You're right. You're right. Mmm. My guy. Bro is committing so hard. Oh, the commitment. The commitment from this man. Chat might not realize how hard his commitments are right now. And they're reasonable commitments to make because the reward is pretty high. RR. Here they are. Wall hit, let's go. Nice. My man, I swear he's like buffering that shit every time there's a high, like, possible. I'm dead. He's in that shit. Round two. Ready, go. Forward. You should be.
Oh, I think you're doing. Please hold your questions till after the fight is over. No. want that. <sighs> yep, that's not safe on the day. <laughs> what got me in the VF? I don't know. I've been playing since I was little. I didn't want to mess my hair up. I'd be doing the whole like thing where you uh, like do the vodka. Like, mm. <laughs> doing that. Round one. Ready? Go. Knock! I thought I broke, but I couldn't. I had to fucking. I had to abare. Uh, okay. Can't duck that. Mm. It is getting warmer, yes. Thank you for replying to my comments. Yeah, yeah. I knew the second I threw that's like I might die here, but it's worth it. I have to establish what you want to do here, regardless. Yeah. 
Where is my shoulder? Still not the right combo. Not the right combo. Knockout. Round four. Ready? Go. Is that a mistake? Must be the back door tent. That was probably forward back and he just got back instead. They went for another throw. Hmm. Risky. So there's no reason for him to have chosen to do that there, because if he did the throw, Ready, go. he would have uh, killed me anyway. Or I would have been. There it is. On, oh, man. I don't believe it. I don't fucking believe it. Round three. Ready, go. Round four. He's like too far. Oh, where's my low block? Excellent. Fuck, man. God damn. Give me a moment, chat. I have to finish this set. Ready, go! Oh, that hit tilted me so hard. Hmm. Hmm. 
We might find new alps here. Round three. Ready, go. one. Why did that hit me? You're dead. Focus on his character. Look at him. Fuck. I, I didn't look at him for like two fucking two exchanges, and it was I was I was dead already. I was already dying. Knockout! Round 
down for. Ready, go! I'm fine with the choice I made there. I'm fine with that choice. Luke, no. So committal, so committal. Round two. Ready, go. My man is prepared to die for his choices. I'm not. I'm very much not. I did get it fast enough. I should end last round. Last match. Round five. Ready, go. I want it using my style. I didn't have to switch to a riskier style. <laughs> oh my god. Okay. Just take a just, just give us a breather. Give us a breather. Give us a breather. Okay. <laughs> give me a second to breathe. That's a very good opening set. Yes, very good. Oh yeah, you can fall off the stage. Oh yeah. Okay, now chat all your questions. Bring them out. Throw them out here. Get, give them to me. While I queue up our next song playlist. Um, cyberpunk remixes.
How did I originally get into VF? Sorry if you said it already. Uh, I, I was a kid at my friend's house. He had it on his uh, free for VF remix, and I played this out and I liked it. I was like, this shit's hot. And I studied martial arts as a kid, and I thought it was, um, okay, let's make it first to five. Fuck. <sighs> so what can so what can VF players find interesting in Tekken 8? Um same play style, just having more players to play with, basically. It's easier to it's easier to uh, find matches. Let's play Cyberpunk Remix um uh, video game song. Let's try that. I'm ready. No, it's not known as claw. Claw grip is with a pad. Pad to use claw grip. This is not. This is just how you. This is just how you put your hands on a. This isn't a claw. This is how you put your hands on a stake. We're switching between the games. Their mode switch comes naturally. They're also not that different. They're not that different. They're they're very similar. Like the way I'm using jab and adjusting my timings and stuff. That's more emphasized. The different things are emphasized in the different games. Um, everything in Tekken is valuable in this game, but there are some skills in this game that aren't necessarily valuable in Tekken. Almost, almost, almost. I almost had it. Round two. Ready, go. Huge read from Paul there. Huge read. Following mud pig. What now? <laughs> Can y'all hear the music well enough? Like fate lay. You could say that, yeah. I could do that. He's using Leo's Leo style. Oh, 
I was right. I was right. I was fucking right. I we've played long enough. I can trust my gut. I do play two Street Fighter 6, yes. Ready, go. I don't have to worry about... Never mind. Fuck my gut. Fuck you, gut. Hi, gamer boy. Round three. Ready, go. Hell, man. Round four. Ready, go. I didn't want to be back turn. Oh. Three. Round one. Ready, go. Three. Keep breathing. Keep breathing. Oh, he's doing forward. You know he's doing forward. Uh, the hard question. Ready, go. Knockout. I timed it to you doing that. Twenty-one frames, bro. It's Twenty-one frames. Don't worry about it. Don't worry about the move. Don't worry about the move. Don't worry about the move. It hurts a lot, and it hurts my soul when I get hit by it. But don't worry about that move. Remind yourself how much of a risk he's taking to do what he's doing. Um, Void, I don't actually know. I don't really pay to keep track. I fought like every, I fought everyone so much that like, I, I have no idea. Yep. It's my fault. I know how to stop that now. I know how to stop it.
Poop is not doing it for me. It is whack. I thought you do. Yes, it just isn't. Round two. Ready, go. Leave your sack. Don't forget. Yeah, you're taking huge ass risks. I forgot how risky you're playing. Like, don't forget. Keep, keep. Keep hitting him with it. Ready, go. Not risky if I don't make it feel risky. Yep. I block that, man. Oh, I hate that shit. I'm hit by it now. I gotta deal with this. But damn it. All because of what happened earlier in the match. Oh, it sucks. I must have been like a frame late on that down block. I must have been like a frame late. Literally a frame. Thanks for watching, Hope Hoop. Too early, too early. Damn it. I was trying to catch that. I didn't. I want to see. I want to see. I want to see. 
Four six kg should have worked, maybe. It's okay. If we're following Tiger. Round one. Ready, go. <laughs> I hit you out of it. I was gonna go under. Have to calm down. Have to calm down. You have to fucking calm the fuck down. When people wonder, they're like, Tricky, how is she so cool, calm, and collected? I'm not. I just know how to calm myself down. I'm a very emotional person. Uh, water. <laughs> I'll tell you afterwards. Stay calm. Stay calm. Extra hit there, but it's okay. Relax. Relax. I'll tell you why he does afterwards. Because if I do the wrong things lightly, I fucking explode. That's why it's so, it's very stressful. And I keep not blocking that low. Like, 
I'm pressing the button, it's just not blocking. I'm too slow. That's really, really, really frustrating. There it is. Ah! Oh, damn it! Good games, good games, good games. And Akira's isn't cheese. It's very hard to do what he's doing. That's why you won't find people that, like, hate Akira. Because he's, he's strong. But you have to be good to be good with him. But when you are good with him, he's really oppressive. Um, I'm drinking Best Day Brewing. It's West Coast IPA. It's a non-alcoholic beer. Not a sponsor. I just drink it all the time. GG's. Oh. Oh. Give me a second. Here comes my suplex. <laughs> Round one. Oh, silly. Oh my god. Good games, Paul. So, here's why that match is stressful. On the side and Paul being, you know, good. I am feeling it. Oh. Very sweaty indeed. So, against Akira, uh, there's a lot of you don't know this, right? Because I have a lot of Tekken hits in here. Uh, so Eileen's what you call a super lightweight. Which means she's the lightest character in the game. And she's very tall. And that's important in this game. Because the taller your character is, the longer combos you can use on them. Thanks for following the fighter. So, um, Akira is pretty heavy. He's not like a heavyweight like Wolf is in front of you. You see him. He's a heavyweight. Kage is like in the middle, lightweight. But Akira is really quite heavy. He's right outside of heavyweight. He's the heaviest middleweight. Which is significant. And he's not that tall. So his legs are kind of stubby. Meaning that combos... You can't get long combos on him. Uh, so think about that for a second. Akira is fighting a character he can just blow up. Because his combos are very, very powerful against her. Um, and Eileen takes a lot of damage and she can't do a lot of damage to him and she can't really pressure him for free either without opening herself up to lots of damage too so but but akira can <laughs> uh you can use system mechanics to play safely and beat nakira but as the eileen you're constantly living on the razor's edge of death if you're a frame late if you're two frames off, you're fucking going to the moon. And Akira can just send it over and over and over again. And even if he isn't sending it super hard, uh, he can send it hard enough that it will hurt you. So what you have to do versus Akira as an Eileen or any character really, with, with an 11 frame jab, which is also significant, you have to evade him. You have to evade his mids because they're all unsafe to things on evade. And she can knock him down on evade. But you have to know when they're going to do the attack. And Paul's been very good at mixing up his timings. Which means I can backdash. But it's he's mixing things up there in a way that is making it hard to play safe. Um, so when you see me get kind of frustrated, it's because either I dropped a defensive input. I didn't... Those low blocks I keep getting hit by those low punches I keep getting hit with that I'm like trying to block and I'm like livid about. I'm, I'm livid because like I have to block those. Like I can't, I can't, I have to either block or evade them. I cannot afford to get hit by those. If I get hit by those, I'm going to lose the matchup. Like, like you're, you're going to lose. It's unwinnable if you don't block those or evade them. So there are certain situations, there, there are a series of things that you have to do versus Akira defensively that if you are failing to do, you will not be able to win. You will lose the matchup. It's impossible to win. 
against an Akira who's hitting you with certain moves. Um, but they're like just good enough that they're hard to stomp. Once you stomp them, then it's easy. But like, I'm just not good enough to stop them consistently. So, you know, it's good practice. I wish I was more consistent at it, but I'm glad. Oh, you say. Worth me to deal with it. It's about to be despicable. It's actually not Lenunia business. Quite the opposite. Um, it's actually not that. Not in this matchup. In other matchups, yes, but Eileen versus Akira, that's not actually the case. I can know exactly what he's going to do, but because Akira's mix-up is so strong, he can cover enough of my options that I can't, even if I know what he's going to do, I can't 100% always cover it. Like, like, I'll get hit by one of them. I have to concede one option at least. Typically, normally two. High risk, high reward. Akira's not high risk, though. That's the problem. He's not high risk. He's low risk, high reward. That's why he's top tier. Eileen's high risk, low reward. That's why she's low tier. That's that's why she's low tier. So I mitigate that, but it doesn't mean I don't get frustrated by it. Like I get I get frustrated like anybody else, because I'm like I know I can get around this. I know I can stop this. I have to display better. I didn't play well enough. Akira is the top tier. He he's the one. He's he is the top. The risk is not very clear. <laughs> the risk is if you evade him. That's the only thing you can really do. If Akira's moves are evaded, you, you you can punish him. That's it. The risk is only if he gets evaded. So if Akira's predictable, which means he's not a good Akira, then you can fuck him up. But if Akira is halfway decent, then you can't do that. But when you do evade him, you have to make it hurt. So I wasn't making his him hurt enough when I did evade him. I was getting a good amount of evades. I wasn't making him hurt enough. Uh, Vanessa is the strongest female character in the game. All the women are bad. All the lightweights in this game are bad. This game is basically... I know people love saying how balanced this game is, and it is really balanced, but like there's a pretty clear problem, which is that lighter characters don't get enough reward for being light, and heavier characters don't pay enough cost for being heavy. So the heaviest characters can, can do a fuck ton of damage, can't be damaged very much, but the lighter characters don't really have anything to compensate for the fact that the heavy characters can hurt them so badly. That's like a real problem, which is why I, I, I'm okay playing other games now. Because I'm like, this is a problem. I would rather there be a new game. Like, I want BF6. I want a new game. I'm tired of playing in this problem of, like, my character is so light. And it's clear as fucking day that the heavy, heavier characters are just better. Because they don't take as much damage. And they do so much. Yeah, that frame P, though. Oh, wow, yeah. Maybe it was 10 frames. Maybe. Is this the same with UK's characters? It won't be. It won't be. I still, don't get me wrong, I, I still like Eileen. It's just stressful. This is why you see me get stressed. Cause like I I know I'm working hard to to, to get my dubs like I I I know that, and I welcome it. It's it, it that's okay. Time for, a combat seminar. for how dangerous Alien is, she's not that dangerous. She's not. She's not. She's dangerous to play with. I don't think the weight glasses are inherently problematic. I think they just didn't do a good job in this last version of it. With it. I think when King or Jeffrey? King. Actually. No more like no. <laughs> it's one of his best outfits, actually. It's, it's a Marduk fit. That hoodie looks so hard. I wish we could color it though. 
Okay, let's get Tekken on the screen. Let's get the Tekken. I'll let this one go. Actually, yeah, we're, we're, we're done anyway. Okay, let's switch over to Tekken. But yeah, this in this version, they fucked up a little bit with the weight classes. Heavyweights are just better. Except for Wolf and Jeffrey. So like the super heavyweights, or like the heavy, like the real heavyweights are, are aren't that good. But the mid mid heavyweights, like midweight people, like Go, John, Akira, Jackie, Brad, all the, those are all considered like the, some of the best characters in the game. All of them are considered that. Heavier characters, like middle heavyweight characters, are all considered strong. All of them. There's not one. They fucked that up. That's what I'm like. They fucked up there a little bit. Whenever a whole weight class is just better than everybody else, you fuck something up. The only character that's really good, that's light, is Leon. He's the only one. The only one. 